Born and raised in the notorious world of drug trafficking, Avila Beltran emerged as a formidable figure in the Mexican drug trade. Her lineage, rife with criminal associations, paved the way for her rise to power in the dangerous and illicit realm of narcotics. Born in Baja California, Mexico, Avila Beltran was the daughter of Maria Luisa Beltran Felix and Alfonso Avila Quintero. Notably, her family connections ran deep, with her bloodline intertwined with some of the most prominent figures in the cartel landscape. Avila Beltran's father, Alfonso Avila Quintero, was a member of the notorious Guadalajara cartel, led by Rafael Caro Quintero and Felix Gallargo. Her family ties extended to the Beltran Leyva brothers, who were at the helm of the Sinaloa Cartel Federation during her criminal career. She was, in fact, a third generation drug trafficker, inheriting a legacy steeped in illicit activities. The influence of her family's criminal connections was palpable throughout Avila Beltran's life. Mexican officials assert that she is the niece of Miguel Angel Felix Gallardo, widely known as the godfather and boss of bosses of the Mexican drug trade. Felix Gallardo was released from prison after serving a 40-year sentence for his involvement in the 1984 murder of Enrique Camarena, a DEA special agent. Furthermore, her great-uncle, Juan José Quintero Payan, faced extradition to the United States on drug trafficking charges. The Beltrans, on her mother's side, first delved into heroin smuggling during the 1970s, later diversifying into cocaine. Avila Beltran, true to her family's legacy, embraced the violence and intimidation tactics that came with the territory. DEA officials attested to her unwavering willingness to employ violence, confirming that she resorted to the typical intimidation strategies employed by Mexican criminal organizations. Notorious for her tumultuous personal life, Avila Beltran had affairs with several well-known drug barons during her youth. She was married twice, both times to ex-police commanders who turned to drug trafficking. Tragically, both husbands met their demise at the hands of hired assassins. Her ascent in the drug underworld can be largely attributed to her most recent relationship with Juan Diego Espinosa Ramirez, better known as the Tiger. Espinosa Ramirez held significant influence within the Colombian Norte del Valle cartel, further solidifying Avila Beltran's standing in the illicit drug trade. For years, Avila Beltran resided in Guadalajara and most of Mexico operating under the radar of law enforcement. However, her criminal empire faced a severe blow in 2001 when authorities discovered over nine tons of cocaine on a ship at the Pacific port of Manzanillo, Colima. The investigation led them directly to Avila Beltran and her partner, Espinosa Ramirez. Avila Beltran's biography is a tale of criminal lineage, intertwined relationships, and the relentless pursuit of power and wealth within the drug trade. Her story serves as a testament to the influence and far-reaching consequences of family connections in the world of organized crime. Thanks for watching.